welcome everyone to one more session in computer vision and image processing tutorial series in this particular session we are going to talk about coordinate detection in uh, in image processing okay so let us begin by importing cv2 library okay so let me import cv2 library and yes if you if you want more such videos from edignite ngo please like share and subscribe to the edignite ngo channel then we need to import numpy okay numpy as np okay so we have imported imported uh, two libraries over here i i am getting an okay i need to write as cv okay import cv2 as cv and import numpy as np now what is actually corner it actually detects the corners and now there are two different different methods for corner detection okay first one is Harris corner detection and the second one is Sitomashi corner detection okay so let us begin with the Harris corner detection so let us uh, let us read first of all let us read an image so I will write img equal to img equal to cv dot I am read I am read okay cv dot I am read I will d dash dash I am g data I am g data dash dash the img data then input and dash dash shapes shapes s h a p s shapes dot jpg dot jpg okay so we have a shapes file over here now we are going to show it okay so i will write cv dot i am show cv dot i am show and image image over here img over there okay and then we will give the weight key okay we will give the weight key and destroy all windows okay cv dot destroy all windows destroy all windows okay so you see that we have given all these things over here and now we will run the code okay so let us run the code over here oh we have got a very big image okay so as we have got a big image let me close it let me close it and over here let me call img okay img img you see i have got an uh, array okay i have got an array of numbers now i will write img dot shape to get the shape okay so it's 780 into 1000 okay this is 780 is the height and 1000 is the width so we will resize it to half so we will write img okay img we can also use image pyramid for this okay cv dot resize cv dot resize and img comma 500 500 and i will i will just write 390 okay 390 i think it's 390 yes it's 390 500 comma 390 and then run the code now you see that i have got the perfect image okay so this this image is from vector stock okay as you can see from here so you see we have got all these shapes over here and now what we will do is we will detect the corners okay we will we will detect the corners. so you see that this is a corner then this is a corner and this is a corner in the triangle okay in parallelogram this is the corner in heart also this is the corner and this is the corner okay so let us detect all these corners now okay so let me let me do first the harris method okay harris harris corner detection harris harris corner detection and in harris corner detection we have a method first of all we need to convert this into a gray image okay we need to convert this into a gray image so let us convert this into gray image img underscore gray img underscore gray equal to cv dot cvt color cv dot cvt color and we will give pass image and cv dot color color underscore bgr to gra by gray okay bgr to gray and we have given this gray image and now what we need to do is we need to convert this image into uh, into an image okay in, 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 into 
to an array which contains floating numbers okay floating point numbers so all these are integers so we need to convert integers okay we need to convert integers into floating point numbers for that we will use np.float library okay so we will write image img img underscore gray img underscore gray and why do we need to do it because this harris corner detection method uses uh, it takes the value as float okay as float so i will i will just write np.float32 float float float32 float32 and over here i will give img underscore gray okay because it accepts the image the array in the form of floating point number array with each element having floating point number data type okay now we will just uh, use the corner detection okay so we will write c underscore d for corner detection and we will give cv dot corner harris cv dot corner harris okay corner corner harris harris okay harris cv dot corner harris okay we we i think we have corner harris over here okay so this is it and i will use the tab okay so first of all we need to give the source okay so source is gray image okay the gray image so we will just give the source img underscore gray okay then we need to give the block size what should be actually the block size of that corner so for that we need we can give two then we need to give the kernel size okay so the kernel size over here over here can be two okay kernel size or it can be three then we need to give the value of k if you have seen the the sobel operations video then the it is it is similar to the aperture parameter okay so over here let us let us first give the value of of k as 0 0.04 okay so let me write 0 0.04 0 0.04 okay so if you haven't seen the sobel operations do check out the playlist and look at the video okay so we have uh, we have detected our corners over here okay we have detected our corners and now what we will do is we will we will just uh, replace we will just replace all the pixels in that particular corner okay in that particular corner to uh, some other pixels okay suppose black pixels or red pixels actually so let me write img img and over here img is an array actually okay so if the res okay the the result or c underscore d cd is greater than if cd is greater than 0 0.0.01 okay 0 0.01 into 0 0.01 into c underscore d dot max okay okay c underscore d underscore max at, as it gives maximum value to the uh, to actually it gives maximum pixel values to the corners okay so it should be greater than max and then we need to give the colors okay so let me give black color over here so it will be 0 comma 0 comma 0 and over here over here we we can show our image okay we will save it and then run the code okay you see that we have got all these corners over here you see we have got all the corners detected okay we have got several corners detected over here over here as well okay so there are several corners detected and we can change it by changing these values okay we can change it by changing these values so block size we can do it as one and then run the code okay you see that now we don't have any corner okay so block size as five and then let us run the code you see that now i have got many corners okay now several corners are detected except the star corner okay so i can increase the block size to seven okay and then i can run the run the code okay still i haven't got this so you, you can see that we have all the corners detected okay we have all the cor corners in the letters as well as shapes detected 
so this way this way we can detect the corner using harris corner detection now we will look at shitomashi corner detection okay so uh, shitomashi it was developed actually by shitomashi and uh, this the, the name of the function is good features to track okay so let us uh, let us comment this out okay i will comment oh, from here let me comment this and i will let me comment this out okay so i have commented this out and for now let us uh, we have run the pi okay so let us see img okay img and i will just pass this parameter so what it is okay so i will i will copy it and i will paste it over here okay you see that it is an array okay it is an array of integers okay so all these are replaced by 0 comma 0 comma 0 all of them are, were replaced by 0 comma 0 comma 0 so all the pixels at corners were replaced by these okay and we can also see c underscore d it is also an array okay c underscore d is also an array and c underscore d dot max okay dot max and you see that we get the maximum value over here okay we get the maximum value over here so over here we will just multiply it by 0 0.01 okay 0 0.01 so we will move the point over here and if if c underscore d is greater than this then you replace it by 0 comma 0 comma 0 okay so now let us move to shitomashi corner detection in shitomashi corner detection First of all, you need to read an image and then you need to convert it into grayscale. Okay, so let me convert this into grayscale. I will copy it and I will paste it over here. Okay, so I have converted this into grayscale and now what can be done is we can detect the corners. Okay, so I will just write C underscore D. Okay, or I will write C O R N E R corner and equal to corner corner equal to corner equal to cv dot good features to track cv dot good features okay good good features good features to track okay good features to track let me press the tab key okay so first of all i need to give the image okay so i will write img underscore gray img underscore gray then I need to give the maximum corners I need to detect. Okay. So the maximum corners can be equal to 100. I want, I can write it at, as 1000 because I want all the corners to be detected. Now I can uh, give quality level as well. Okay. Minimum quality level or the level to which it should get zoomed in okay so i can give it to 0 0.001 okay 0 0.001 and minimum distance okay minimum distance in between both the corners should be at least 10 pixels okay so i have given this corner over here okay i have detected the corner now what i will do is i will just convert this into corner dot okay i will convert this convert this into an array of integers so corner equal to np dot int int 64 int 64 and over here i will give corner okay corner and this particular thing will will pass an array of coordinates okay so let me just write for i in corners corner okay corner for i in corner i will write i x comma y x comma y equal to here when you write i then i each and every element is a two dimensional array okay so we first need to flatten this array so we will write i dot ravel okay ravel ravel function is for flattening the array so we have flattened the array and we have stored each element into x and y okay the x coordinate is stored in x and y coordinate in y and now what we will do is we will draw a circle over here so i will write cv dot circle cv dot circle okay first of all i will give the image so img then i can give the the center so center will be x comma y x comma y okay x comma y then let us give the radius okay so radius can be equal to uh, four pixels okay then we can give the 
the color okay so color values can be color values can be equal to uh, 255 okay b then g can be 100 comma 255 255 comma 100 comma 255 okay so it it is a kind of purple color and then we can give minus one okay as we need to fill the full circle so we have uh, filled it and now we have shown the image okay so what is done in shidomashi method first of all we have converted into gray no need to convert it into floating point array okay so then we have detected the corners in corners we have this is uh, this is the image okay this is the source this is the maximum number of points that we want to detect this is the quality okay as low is the quality less is the quality more will be the corners detected okay and this is the minimum distance between two corners okay this should be minimum distance if distance between two corners is five then one will be detected one will not okay so let us run the code okay you see that we have we have several dots over here okay we have several dots over here in the in the image now what can be done to minimize the dots for that we can first of all we can use 20 and we can increase the quality to 0 0.01 okay i have increased the quality to 0 0.01 you see now we have less number of dots okay we have increased the distance as well as we have decreased okay we we have decreased the amount of quality we have increased actually the quality okay so here we have uh, these dots and now if i do i can if i do 0 0.9 okay or i if i do 0 0.1 over here then you will see that quality will be decreased more you see that we don't have corners around star okay we actually don't have corners around star we don't have corners around here okay and if you if it's 0 0.01 it's if it's 0 0.01 then we have corners around star okay we have corners around star now we can also increase this value to 25 okay we can increase this value to 25 you see that we have less number of uh, corners detected okay we can increase this value to 50 also so you see that now very less dots are detected okay very less dots are detected so this was about coronal detection in open cv that's it for this particular session thank you everyone